Hey, this is Chase, and uh, I came across a question that someone asked me, and uh, although I don't have a whole lot of experience, I think I found a good answer, but the question was how to make model airplane fuel. And so I came across this website, and I'll put the link in the description of this video. And it seems fairly uh, self-explanatory here, um, and it talks about <clears throat> the history of uh, building and flying model airplanes here, which is cool. Um, pretty simple things, measuring cups, respirator, okay, for safety, safety goggles, rubber gloves, three gallon plastic container, it looks like it should be, say, container, Baker's AA castor oil, Klotz KL200 oil, methanol, and nitromethane, and some HDPE gallon jugs, okay? So, go through, and I'll have these uh, instructions in the description of the video as well. But prepare yourself for handling methanol, okay, by wearing the respirator, the rubber, rubber gloves, and the goggles. Four cups of Baker's AA castor oil into a plastic container that is at least three gallons. Then you can add the four cups of Klotz KL200 oil to the plastic container, okay? Then add 28 cups of methanol to the mixture. <clears throat> then add four cups of nitromethane to the mixture. Mix the ingredient ingredients well. Then pour the fuel immediately into the HD HDPE gallon jugs that can be firmly sealed to prevent moisture in the air from mixing with the chemicals. Okay, it's an important step. And then just store the fuel and all chemicals in an environment between 50 and 75 degrees Fahrenheit, okay? Now, as a uh, tip again and a warning, methanol is very, is very, or is highly flammable, okay, and volatile chemical. So that should be handled very carefully and, and stored very carefully as well, okay? So um, that's the information I found, the article. It looks very good. It's on eHow. I will put the link in the description of this video. Hope you enjoy this video. Have a great day. Bye for now.